हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक ऑन डिस्ट्रीम चैनल गाइस आई एम राम किस सिंह यूनिटी गेम डेवलपर यूट्यूबर एंड ब्लॉगर इन टुडे ट्यूटोरियल वी आर गोइंग टू टॉक अबाउट आर इंट्रेक्शन 3.0 पॉइंट ओ मीन्स ऑल द गोइंग टू लर्न दिस वन लाइक थ्री वर्जन ऑफ द एक्स आर इंट्रेक्शन टूल किट तो एवरीथिंग इज ओके बिकॉज बिफोर दैट एवरीथिंग इज गेटिंग डेप्रिकेटेड नॉट एवरीथिंग मीन्स ऑल द मेन स्क्रिप्ट लाइक हैंड्स कंट्रोलर और लेफ्ट एंड राइट लोको मोशन सो एवरी थिंग हैव बिन डेप्रिकेटेड करेंटली दे हैव लॉन्च थ्री पॉइंट जीरो डॉट फोर यूज दैट वन एंड नाउ इट इज वट एवर दे आर लॉन्चिंग द टेम्पलेट दे आर यूजिंग द सेम लाइक इन द टी वी आर मल्टीप्लेयर टेम्पलेट सो दे हैव यूज द सेम एक्सप्लेन इफ यू हैव नॉट वॉच सो यू कैन जस्ट गो एंड वॉच इन टू डे टूटोरियल वॉट आई एम गोइंग टू डू विल टेक अ न्यू प्रोजेक्ट आई कैन टेक वी आर मल्टीप्लेयर और आई कैन टेक वी आर सो दीज आर द टू ऑप्शन बट इफ यू वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट अ totally fresh project i am going to tell you that how you can set up here is the unit universal 3d code and here i will just create new project so before proceeding further if you are new on the channel make sure subscribe the channel if you want to support the channel you can join here it will give me some amount to create much more tutorial for you or you can become my patreon or you can just grab any sample let's start the 2d video you can check out me on my linkedin profile you can ask question or you can join the discord channel where you can ask or discuss with the community okay great so let's come to the unity hub so here i am creating the universal 3d pipe so basically in last tutorial getting started with vr i told you that you can go with this so if it is giving you the older version so that's not okay so we are just doing the setup from the starting so you know everything so it is a very important series where i will explain much more about the xr interaction toolkit because we are getting the special keyboard as well as we are getting the hands tracking in this series we will cover this thing also the download template basically these are the new and it will be continue for longer term and connect to unity cloud so i am connecting because if we are going to use anything in this series so i will explain there so just create this i have opened the project and basically i am using the latest version of unity 2022 it is a lts version because i wanted to just make sure that everything is updated but in the future if you are going with the unity 6 so i will see that what is coming in unity 6 in lts version so for this just go on the build setting setup is really simple so you have to go on the xr plugin management this step will be same as the previous one so just do the install xr basically there is two way that is the unity xr and meta xr so i am doing the unity xr so it will be create the build for meta quest devices also but if you want to use the meta xr rig so what you have to do you have to just go on the asset store and from there you need to grab the meta xr all in one package and that's it so that will help you so here we have done the so we need open xr so we can choose the open xr it will install and basically open xr help us to make the cross platform our application so whenever we use the unity xr so our application will run on the all the devices so just do the restart so here we are in unity again and here you can see open xr have been installed here is the project validation so basically we are on this platform so we can do the fix all so just okay so currently we are in the windows system and here we are on the open xr so here we have to go on android device and currently we are on everything is okay and looking great okay great and here we can go on the xr plugin management here we can choose we are creating for oculus build so we so i've choose the oculus and here we are on the android and if you are going on the system so you can choose the open xr basically uh, it will help us to just use the xr link so great and here what it is showing open at least one interaction profile must be added okay so we will do that thing there is no any issue so basically it is asking to add the profile here so if you want to use so you can add one by one everything for now if you want to use so you can use oculus touch controller profile so just do this thing so this error will be gone okay great so basically we have installed basic stuff that will help us to run and here we have to go on the package manager and here we are xr plugin management we have so whenever we are going in unity register and here you can see we are able to get the xr interaction toolkit 2.5.4 so this is the currently we are getting in unity people are asking that how we can grab the 3 version so for this you have to go on the website see we are able to see the what new version is so basically they have deprecated 
the older older one like this will be deprecated so currently they, it is not available they are recommending to use this one but in the future we will get the three so basically it is in uh, testing but it is 100% sure that in coming days that will be used everywhere because in their VR multiplayer template they are using this so I'm sure that they will use it so currently here we are getting this one but you can see this is the latest version that release on 26 2024 so basically we want to grab this is the latest version 304 so currently it is not available in the unity by default but in the future it will come so here you can see from the three version we are getting the uh, most updated thing so currently it is this version so just do the aid this version so it will open here so here you can see we are getting 304 so just do the aid stuff and this link I will provide in the description you can check out or also you can just search by default so you will get it. so now you can see that we have installed three version great and here is the dependency here is the samples so you can see in the samples earlier we were getting the start asset that is great hand interaction demo so it was in 2.54 but it is now uh, great and there is also a demo so it is great we will talk in the future AR starter asset legacy xr input special keyboard so that is the beauty of unity that they have created the keyboard because there was really required thing the keyboard we were using the system keyboard and sometimes it was not working but it is really great work unity and this is for the vision OS. so what we need we need the starter asset so just do the starter asset and for now we just only need the starter asset in next part we will talk about the hand tracking so at that time i will tell you that what packages we need so here you can see that is the project and here it is asking interaction layer 31 will be teleport to teleportation to locomotion i know it so just do the fix okay great so everything is looking great so just close this one and we have the open xr and here we have the starter asset okay great so earlier what we were doing so here i am taking one plane basically this is the most easiest thing so here we were just doing the xr and xr origin so here we are not getting that much stuff basically it is the just camera so this is the not good way earlier they have done the setup let me make sure that you have deleted the main camera so let me show you first started asset then i will come up with this so here you can see this is the demo scene in demo scene they have set up everything like you can climb you can do you can pick up the thing so here we have the xr rig and everything have been set up so first of all i will explain this and let me play this through the oculus link and will explain everything and i will share that how you can use this player directly in your scene. the new things i will explain so this video is going to a, a bit little bit longer so you have to keep the patience and watch the whole tutorial that you don't miss anything connected with my oculus link let me show you everything one by one so first thing here you can see this is the teleport way so this is the anchor thing and this is the like if you want to teleport so in this area they have edit and if i am moving so here you can see this is the effect on my head and it will help us to just reduce the like uh, uh, motion thickness because you are not able to see that much whenever you are moving it's really great you should implement in every game so that's really great thing you want to move so this is the teleport area okay, you can also click and if you are going to closure so you are able to close you are able to press the button so this is the great using your hand so you can just change this value and this is the also button you can press so this is the great setup and you can grab anything with the ray also you can just use your controller so in next video i will explain to you that how you can use the hand tracking in this but for now this is the great start video and here we can grab so you can just increase the size little bit also these are different kind of kinematic movement instant movement velocity so if you want to just understand properly so you can let me know in the comment box we will do tutorial on those thing also I have added like you can just climb this thing so it is really great and they have also mentioned in the vr multiplayer as well as you can just 
climb this stairs okay great whenever anything movement is happening so on the my head it is something black is coming okay great so let me explain in unity that what we are getting the new thing here so here is the xr origin everything is great and here you can see this is the input action so it was using the earlier also here we are using this one and now we have to not add anything one by one so everything we are getting here they added the xr input modularity so basically currently we are using the left controller right controller and in the they have also integrated that tracking hands tracking so whenever hand will be here so we will get two reference we will add so we will talk about in the future so basically it will help us to just transition from controller to hand hand to controller so that's the great thing and in terms of we talk about the movement so here is the our player whenever you are going inside this player so this is the camera offset and this is the main camera so there is not that much changes but in terms of locomotion so for the locomotion in 2.54 they are created the another another folder you can say or another game object but now what happening it is same and if you are going to 2020 if you are going 2020 version so that was we are we were adding on the xr origin but in the locomotion here you can see we are getting the locomotion mediator locomotion system have been removed so in the three version you are getting the locomotion mediator and you are getting the xr body transformer so basically you need this two component to just move your player and here you can see on the move we are earlier we are getting the continuous move provider but currently they are providing the dynamic move provider so you have to always use dynamic move provider everywhere whenever you want so this is the locomotion system basically they have removed with this two component and whatever we want feature so here you can see for movement we will use dynamic move provider and it was also in 2.54 and for the turn earlier it was continuous turn provider but now we are getting snap turn provider so it's snap turn provider was in meta xr but currently we are getting in unity xr also and this is for grabbing so for grabbing this thing works and this is for teleportation provider on this platform i told you that it is working as a teleportation provider on the xr rig we were adding the teleportation provider so it is compulsory if you want to just move your means you want to teleport things so you need teleportation provider and if this object want to uh, if on this object we want to teleport so at that location we have to add teleportation area and make sure that you have passed the collider as well as you have to make sure it is the teleport layer okay great and for the climb they have added this thing climb and at that time you have to also pass this reference and as well as you have to add climb teleport so you have to add climb teleporter interactor climb teleporter destination interactor so this is the great thing and i explained to you and here we need xr interaction manager so this was the same and here we need event system on event system if you want to interact with the ui so make sure xr ui input module have been added so if you want to add this thing in your separate scene like this is the sample scene so there is two way first way is just you go here and you go in the version you go here and here you will get the prefab you can use this directly and you are getting the locomotion stuff you are getting all the stuff here so you can use directly and if you want to just do the teleportation thing so at that time you have to add here teleport area so if you are going to use this one so let me show you but you will not get few stuff what so let me show you that what you are not going to get so here you can see we are able to move we are able to so if you want to create the normal thing like you don't want the what they call vaginity like black kind of stuff so this is the great and if you will add the teleportation area so it will also start working and your hand controller is also looking so that's great so for the starting in any scene if you want this much stuff like you are able to move you are able to perform the basic stuff you are able to rotate so you can use the prefab but i will suggest that if you are going to use 
like Vignity and I will recommend that you should do so you can create another prefab or what you can do you can just go here on the demo scene just get the demo scene and here you have to just copy this stuff as well as if there is nothing this kind of stuff so you have to copy this three stuff and you have to go in your scene and here you have to delete this one and this is already integrated so you have to not do anything and here extra interaction manager is already there so just you can delete this one and here you are getting everything like on the player what they are doing on the for the vignity so let me explain so on the here you can see turn tunneling vignity so they have added this component and this is the script and it is asking for some references like whatever providing the motion so we need these references and they have added a different kind of shader graph so the here you can modify the color if you want to do so this is helping to create the vignity effect so let me run and you will see that everything we are getting here okay so now you can see we are getting everything here so you have to not add separately like there was earlier locomotion rotation but now we are getting this effect also and this effect is really great because you will not feel the motion sickness you can use oculus for much more time so everything is okay so everything have been set up and for the interaction like locomotion or anything so basically all everything is coming with this and if you want to create this in the teleportation area so you can use teleportation area and here we need to pass teleport and here we need the collider so just add the collider now we are ready to teleport here so we are getting everything like normal movement as well as also we are getting the teleportation stuff mm -hmm. so here you can see i am able to teleport so we are able to teleport in terms of if you want to create the build so what you have to do so make sure uh, which scene you want to create the build so here we are getting scene in build you can click the control shift f also you can just go on the build setting and here we are on the window so basically you can add the scene so make sure that which scene you want to perform so this is the sample scene so add the sample scene here okay great now you have to convert in android so switch the platform everything is set up so go in the player setting here is the default company so you can just give any name so this is the nest and mango and this is the unity xr there is anything and this is i'm not going to do any optimization so everything is okay now you can create the build if you want to just change so now we will get the our package name okay great so now you can just build so give the test xr and your apk will be create okay great so that's it for today tutorial hope you enjoy and i request to you that please if you are new on the channel make sure to subscribe the channel and please like the video it will really help me to inspire and also it help us to it help us to reach much more people like you because youtube algorithm supports the like so thanks for watching have a good day see you in next video bye bye take care and in next video we will talk about the hand tracking so see you in next video